guys, it's Daffodilian, and welcome to my Generations cast. Here are my Sims for my new Generation C uh, LP that's coming out. Uh, it'll be uh, not this Friday, but next Friday. Yeah, you're seeing this on Wednesday, and then this Friday is not so berry. Or and then next Wednesday is their the deck the speed build for their apartment the speed apartment, and then. That Friday decorate will be the episode of this. And you can see I just started with some pre-existing sims I already had. I already had like a couple that I had made and never really played with. But I loved them so I was like I'll go ahead and give them a makeover. But you'll see I don't really change much with dude because he's not really, spoiler, he's not really OP that much. So I figured, you know, I can leave him about the same. He go back up at the end of the LP. We'll see. There's a very juicy backstory. <laughs> very juicy backstory. Um, I'm tweaking her a lot because I wanted her to be much different than the original Sim. I wanted her to be more of her own Sim and less of the Sim I'd already created. In fact, I actually picked these two Sims because I thought both of them had already been dressed. And I was like, oh. I won't even have to dress or change their outfits too much. I apparently had not done her outfits, so that's kind of embarrassing for me. The outfits I had done, and you'll see whenever it comes to him that uh, I really did change some of his outfits. And I barely need to change his hair, because I feel like his hair makes him look really young and it does his personality. I really need to download some new male hairs because... I just, I couldn't find one that I liked that fit him very much, so he wound up with the same hair. And uh, during this, I cut out some parts, and it's mostly just my hairs, my female hairs. I have, like right there, the entire loading of my female hairs because there were so many. And I may or may not, this entire sim, Miss Fawn Simmons, I may or may not have based her in sim <laughs> off of that hair because I downloaded it and I was like I need a sim for this hair and uh, that's exactly what I did is I made a sim for that hair and uh, I think it worked out pretty well I think she's um but her hair is actually kind of reddish especially toward, uh because the original sim had kind of her hair so it's really red and I love it it is great I'm kind of sad I had to get rid of it I didn't like it with that hair like the way it like the gradient and I don't know. I went really casual for her. I spent a long time trying to find shirts and then I kept scrolling up and down like new shirts were going to appear or something. I need to get more CC but also I don't want to get too much to break my game but I need new CC you know. I'm just, I just loaded all this new CC and I want more. But I, I did find a, an outfit that I liked. I really love her pants. I went to Lance in real life. I uh, just they are goals. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> but I love them. See those? Mm hmm I love those. I go to change the color, but I actually don't because I really love the yellow. Uh, and you'll see on the shirt here in a second after I, once I get, you'll see on the shirt between like two different designs and I eventually set a shirt on the shirt that had like light kind of design on it because I really liked how like the story night like painting on the shirt really tied into her pants and here that is but like I don't know it just it brought me joy like that one those two are the ones I went between and uh, I wound up going with that one because it, it was great <laughs> and I didn't know what to do for her formal I was like um I don't know too formal but then I was like a little bit of party animal because she's like great stuff and I was like what's something someone would wear to the bachelorette party because I feel like that's gonna be the only time she wears her formal well other than her wedding but a long ways off. I guess that's where right party will be a long ways off too. Her legs, you'll see she's wearing like pantyhose that like only go up to like mid thigh or something. I could not figure out what is happening and I was like I bet you it's those weird like pantyhose socks things she's wearing and sure enough that's but I love that like dark red color. I put as you can see it's a preset of mine and I put so many of my sims in that dark red color I love it that and that dark orange and the dark green love all of <laughs> and you'll see I go on here on her uh, athletic wear I put her in like a coral type of shirt and uh, it was just like a random it's just like the first thing I clicked on and then 
once I put her in it, I was like, I really like this. <laughs> and I just went with it. And also, I'm kind of sad that I had to use those shorts. Because I wasted to find any. Also, this outfit. Love this outfit. <laughs> love this outfit. If I'm not scared of short of skirts, this is totally something I would wear. Because I like whole look with like the dress or like the short skirt. With like the... They're awesome. Also, I just... I, I know I just changed the boots from black to black. But they're really shiny black and like didn't like it so i changed it and also i changed her like under sweater to green and i kind of regret it i kind of actually really liked it with like that light tan but it's fine <laughs> and I had her traits planned out um and i didn't realize when i clicked through them because you saw i got rid of all the traits that was and like when that was brave and so then i had to go all the way back to the top after i I had clicked all the other traits and go back to Brave, and I was like, why did I so made her? With my Sims, I really just, I just, for some reason, I'm like, what, what star sign, sign should they be? And it doesn't really make much of it. This Sim really feels like a Leo to me. And also, for him, I forgot to record, like, the first part. I'm over. I don't know why. I'm just, I'm a flop, and I forgot to record the very first bit. But basically his name is, so I tanned him up a bit, and then his eyes so long trying to find this brown. Because I really wanted to go for like a light brown, but then I wound up going for a dark brown because I could not find a light. It's kind of sad about it, but it's fine. And then I tried to change his, you can see that nothing really changed. His lips were a little more defined. Too bad, he looked kind of long. I don't know, I could go back to that hair. I don't think it matters, we're about to kick him out of the household. <laughs> I just did the like setup for the backstory, so whenever the generations hoping comes out, a day or two already because I was setting up the whole backstory, and so uh, he's about to be kicked out. Spoiler there as well. <laughs> I'm really bad at spoiling things. That it's not like the that was initially, like whenever you load in the game and you like make your Sims and then you move them into a world and like a house. I just like picked some ones out of my like little saved sims and threw them in and then decorated them. I say I am, um, well I'm, it's not that I'm lazy, it's just that my um, clothing takes forever to load and warm and I was like I'm not about to make a cast video and have clothing take forever to load. Also I'm kind of sad I didn't use that like long, like three quarter length sleeve. And then here you'll notice that I like decorated this whole like decorated change the colors on that whole swimsuit and then I had to change it because I had that weird sh but you've also noticed that I didn't do wear any sleepwear and I barely changed the health outerwear because I changed the outerwear too honestly I didn't touch the um everyday wear at all I don't think um so that's a whoops I didn't change the everyday wear at all so yikes and also I think my video is almost done because all I have left to do is traits so um, I'm going to go ahead and end it here guys and um, see you guys on Friday for Not So Berry Part 4.